I feel like D-Lo Brown mixed with CeeLo Green Mixed with De La Soul, mixed with Hennessy Sipping gin and juice like I'm Snoop D-O-double-G I'm all about the W, yeah we on the winning streak Yeah, I'm taking L's to the face, girl I beat it up like I'm Triple G But that's only if you let me, Hey, hey, Don't you disrespect me, put respect up on my name When you call, let it What's up guys, this is T from T&J And this is week one As you can see, we are going up against the Cleveland Browns on Monday night, prime time. Man, I love the Monday night games. Um, in real life, I wish the Titans got more prime time games. Uh, but whatever, man. We're still working through our kinks in real life. Um, so I, I, I can wait for that. But anyway, um, today I want to wear the blue bottoms tonight. The Color Rush uh, baby blue um, pants uh, against the Browns. But um, this Browns team... Has Aaron Rodgers at quarterback, DeMarco Murray at running back, and Des Bryant at receiver. So we're going to have our hands full on defense. We're going to put that uh, defensive secondary to the test and um, see if we can hold down Aaron Rodgers. And on the first possession, I throw a pick. I don't know how that guy was able to jump that pass. I thought I had enough room to get it in there. Uh, but after the first drive, I throw a pick. And here we got Aaron Rodgers trying to drive down the field. And we get a nice breakup on that side by Tank. He sitting in the pocket, has all day. Coverage was good, but Aaron Rodgers, I forget sometimes he can run. And he picks up the first down. And DeMarco Murray is inside the 10. And they'll get him down here at about the 5 yard. That's one thing about my defense. We're pretty stout in the red zone. So, as you can see, Jarrell Casey just clogging up the hole right there. And, um, yeah, I really like that the D-line plays really hard around the goal line. So, here we are, third and goal, desperately needing them to stop. We don't want to open the season like this. And he gives the ball to DeMarco Murray, and somehow we do not make the tackle on the edge, and he walks in the end zone untouched. Our second drive with Deshaun Watson, we hold on to the ball way too long right there, and I take a sack. Second down and 20, we find our man Travis Benjamin over the middle, splitting that cover two, and there's a big game right there. It'll get his mo momentum up. And on a third and six, he throws an air pass out of bounds, but we go for it on fourth down, same route, and he connects, and it is a first down to Taewon Taylor. First and 10, we find again Taylor for another first down. And right now we're building up some momentum. Third and goal, trying to get it in. And we roll out and we do not find a receiver. So we have to settle for a field goal right there. Um, we can build off that. So here we are on defense and DeMarco Murray gets another crease on a counter to the left side. That was a nice play call by him. And um, he's actually doing pretty good mixing up the pass and the run. So here we are with the run again. And we get a great block shed from LaMarcus Joyner. Third and seven. He has all day, and he finds a receiver for a deep touchdown. But we have a flag. This is an offensive holding and he is now faced with the long third and 17 so we will drop back our guys on this one make sure nothing gets uh thrown deep and he slings one and it is incomplete um had no choice but to give somebody a shot but here we are we talked about him donnell pumphrey getting a punt return early on and he takes it off to the left and just outruns the the defense and trickles down the sideline for a Titans touchdown. The first touchdown of the year goes to Donnell Pumphrey. So here we are, 10 to 7, trying to get another stop before halftime, and he is still moving the ball. And Rodgers is almost perfect throwing the ball. And here we are, throwing a corner route, and he finds this guy again. So he's moving the ball, stopping the clock, trying to get some points on the board. And he throws another connection on the left side of the field this time. And in the red zone, and like I said, my defensive line is stout. Um, 
in the red zone, and we forced them to a field goal. Um, and I'm, I'm happy about that. So third quarter, Rodgers still dotting it up. I um, think that's Des Bryant right there. And um, he's trying to mix it up, but the run game is not doing anything. Uh, my D-line is doing everything it needs to do to hold him down. And we finally, finally get in for the sack. Um, Brian Arakpo coming off that edge is very big for us. So we get the sack, and now we have the ball. We give it to Derrick Henry, and he finds a crease, runs over a guy. And does he have enough juice to get to the end zone? He it's does not, but do we will that. take that run all day. Huge game. Here we are in the red zone. Try to throw the screen, but we try. Oh, we improvise, and Deshaun Watson gets into the end zone, showing his athletic ability. Deshaun Watson can make things happen when everything breaks down. And the Cleveland Browns are struggling to protect Rodgers at this point. We got a rag pole in there for three sacks now. Getting in the end zone. So back to Henry. Again, finding a crease in the middle. And this time he has enough juice. And he is in for the touchdown. Derrick Henry. Man, that guy is going to have an awesome year. I already know it. And um, that's going to be our MO. We're going to try to get up big and run the ball. Ooh, that was our rookie corner right there. That was a nice breakup. Um, but we're going to run the ball, and hopefully um, this defensive secondary can hold it down in the second half. And we're going to just run the ball in the second half. So that's what we're doing. Um, looking, looking at the secondary, we don't look so bad. I mean, we are playing against Aaron Rodgers. So intercepted. Picked by Kevin Byard. Kevin Byard, and he is gone. I talked to you guys about Kevin Byard, and that guy is going to be around the ball all year because he just, man, he makes plays. So 31 to 10 now, and right now he's in desperation mode, trying to muster up any points he can get. So we are dropping back in a safe coverage, and he cannot find a receiver, and he is down again for a sack. That is Jarrell Casey showing up in the box chart with his second sack of the game. Again, he has all day. We just try to contain Aaron Rodgers, make him throw a, a, a pass into coverage, but he sends it deep, and it is caught inside the 20. That was a lucky catch right there. And fourth and five, we lock down on the outside. That is Tank again locking up on that side. So here we are just trying to waste off the clock. And we give the ball to Donnell Pumphrey, and the hole is massive. Donnell Pumphrey makes a miss. Donnell Pumphrey uses his speed, and he is gone. What a game for Donnell Pumphrey, and he will dance his way into the end zone for another touchdown. Donnell Pumphrey is special, guys, I'm telling you. I mean, he just makes play after play. That's why we're putting him at the starting position. Like I said, they both will get carries, him and uh, Derrick Henry. Um, but you can see his explosiveness. And, um, wow, man, what a game. Um, our secondary played awesome, in my opinion. Ending the game with a pick. That is LaShawn Sims. I picked him up out of free agency. And just wanted to get another Titan on this roster. And he showed up big for me at the end and prevented them from getting any points. But there you have it. That is week one um, against the Browns. And we take care of business early. And although Deshaun Watson did not have a game that wowed you, the run game was evident. The pass coverage was, you know, above average. And I can't, man, I cannot be more proud what I did in the offseason to get this team prepared and better. So, guys, tune in, subscribe. Don't forget to hit that like button and come back for more from T, from TNJ. Peace.